You know, there comes a time in everyone's life when you ever you have to deal with a funeral for someone, whether you're actually someone in your family that's passed, or if you're maybe doing some pre-planning for your own self or you know, years down the line. Well, when you do that, you want to work with a company that's uh, reliable, that uh, you know, takes care of your needs. Well, if you live in the Stone County area or the surrounding area, the place to come to is right here in McHenry. It's called Trinity Funeral Services. That's where we are here today. So let's go in and find out more information about Trinity. Now, Kent Kreider, Wayne Flurry are the owners here. How are you doing, gentlemen? Uh, Good to uh, be up here with you. And of course, you know, Wayne, I've been up here uh, visiting with you a little bit before. Give us a little bit of background, if you would, about yourselves here. Ourselves or the funeral service? Well, I mean, you've, you've done this for a while and uh, also about Trinity. I'm a lifelong resident of Stone County and uh, about five years ago or so had a, uh, a thought to open a funeral service to try to bring some uh, assistance to folks in South Mississippi and surrounding areas. Mm -hmm. um, funeral services are, uh, can be really expensive and we wanted to help with that and here we are. Well, you know, as, as I uh, mentioned um, out front, you know, whether you um, are at a situation where you have a sudden death, where you have to, you know, schedule something at need, right. um, is, is, of course, a big difference between that and pre-need. Of course, we, you know, we always want, you know, tell you to come, you know, talk to someone uh, pre-need and make plans a, a ahead because you do save a, a substantial amount of money in, that, in that, uh, that time. Well, not only money, but the burden as well. All right. the information that's needed at need for you know, the state and, and, and other factors. Uh, mm -hmm. if, as much of it as you can pre-plan and, and pre-arrange, the, the less the burden is on the family. Mm -hmm. um, it's a hard day to lose a loved one. And, yes, it is. And so uh, we're here to help in that regard. And you know, one of the things too is whenever you are planning ahead, you know, you need to think about your family. You need to think about the burden that it does put on them. You know, you might think, oh, my insurance will cover it. Sure, your insurance may cover something like that happening, but they still have to go through and make those arrangements because right. that's what, and that could cause quite a bit of a hardship, you know, emotionally wise. And a lot of people don't think about that. Exactly. And, and uh, again, it's, it's probably the most difficult day you'll face to lose the one that you care about the most. Mm -hmm. And uh, I hope that, uh, you're ready for that day, or as best you can be, because you never really can be. Yeah, you know, one of the things that I, that I really li liked about uh, Trinity coming in here is you make such a, a warm family atmosphere whenever you come in and talk to you. You know, come in, sit down in the break room, have a cup of coffee whenever you're trying to make plans before you take a tour of it and look around things. That's and right. That, that's important to y'all. It, it is, and that's, that's what we were shooting for, was a, a, a welcoming environment. I mean, we want to help you. We mm -hmm. want to love on you and help you, know, help you from a pastor's heart uh, just to take care of you. Mm -hmm. And in doing so, to provide you with a dignified service at an affordable price. All right, well, we want to take you on a little tour here of Trinity Funeral Services on Highway 49 in McHenry. Well, we're in the parlor, as they call it now. Right. And uh, tell us, if you would, the steps that you take once you get a call for someone at need. Well, we uh, pick up the deceased and, mm -hmm. and bring them back here. Uh, the family comes in to make the arrangements with Kent and I, and um, we decide what kind of service we're going to have. Either it's going to be a cremation or a traditional service or any variation in between. Um, you can actually have a viewing with a cremation. Um, or you can have a closed casket service, whatever you decide. That's up to the family, mm -hmm. whatever brings them closure. Now, whenever you have the service, I like the way you have this parlor set up. People could kind of, I mean, you, you've got a screen back here, you can do a video. I guess they can provide you with uh, uh, pictures, things That's like right. that they put That's together. Right. We can, uh, we can actually make them a DVD uh, with music backgrounds, a oh, life nice. tribute DVD, or just a simple slideshow to run through on the screens. We have one here and there's one in the, in the uh, break room back there that we were just in. So not only here, they can watch it in other places as well. Correct. And the way this is set up, the, you know, the, the families can set up it here and the, the uh, visitors, those paying their respects, walk through here and usually you have you know, the casket in front of this area where we're sitting at. Here. Right, or the urn, we'll just mm -hmm. sit on a table with mm -hmm. a picture, whatever whatever they want to make them feel comfortable. That's that's our goal, is to minister to the family and to mm -hmm. help them feel comfortable. Okay, well, we want to walk in and show you where the chapel is down. They have a chapel here as well at Trinity Funeral Services on Highway 49 in McHenry. Now, Kent, you're the funeral director here. That's correct. Give us a little bit of rundown of exactly, you know, what options that they do have available. Okay. We do offer the traditional burial, which mm -hmm. is the old mm -hmm. 
program that everybody's mostly used to. And a lot of people now, due to constraints of money-wise, is going to a cremation. Mm -hmm. But some, a lot of times with a direct cremation, it's hard for the family and the grandkids to accept what happened to granddad. He went off to work, and I hadn't seen him since. Right. So we're able to embalm and we have a rental casket that the insides are removable and mm -hmm. they become that person's okay. and uh, they're placed in the rental casket. They can have a traditional viewing, have a traditional service and then afterwards they're cremated and it gives better closure to the family. Then the grandkids understand that granddad didn't just go off to work and never right. come home. Right. And uh, that's what we're for is the family, you know, yeah. what it takes for them to get through it. You do have a, a really nice selection of caskets here as well as urns yes. that people can choose from. We have a location also in Lumberton. Mm -hmm. We have 14 here and six in Lumberton. So we have a total of 20 caskets wow. in stock and we've got a warehouse close by that we can pretty well get anything they want. We've got them from a, the plain old pine box, as they refer to, <laughs> to uh, just as fancy as you I tell you, you what, those wooden, those wooden caskets, they're nice. They really are. They're locally, we have them locally made. Now, as far as, let me ask you this real quick. Um, cemeteries, I guess it, it, it's fine. And I know, you know, being out here in the country, a lot of people have their own little family plots at, uh, on their property or anything. Is that a problem? No. No. You service them as, you service them as well? Any, yeah. We, we go to cemeteries in, in the county, mm -hmm. coast counties. We go north, we've gone So you're not just centered for Stone County? No. No, okay, we have done services almost to Jackson. Really? Yeah. That's that's awesome. That's awesome. Yeah. And and of course, you know, we we haven't even really touched about uh, so much about uh, the uh, pre need at need, but uh, again, except the importance of planning ahead. And I know you've got some wonderful uh, staff here, and uh, Tara's here. If you want to you know, come and talk to her about doing pre need planning or anything like that. A lot of times, when it comes down to the at need, mm -hmm. the the family has to go through with. Daddy would have liked this one, and another one says, well, I think Daddy would have liked this casket, and so forth. But if Daddy had come by and said, this is what I wanted, then it takes no out. The con there's no argument. There's no confusion. They say, well, fine, if that's what Daddy wanted. you know. And sometimes they may want something a little nicer. Mm -hmm. But, but you know, some of them will come in, and, and like Mama will pick something pink, mm -hmm. and they say Mama's not a pink type, mm -hmm. you know. So it, it helps to, if mom and dad has made those decisions. That's awesome. Gentlemen, it's been great Thank talking you. to y'all. Thank you. So if you're needing to make some plans pre-need or at need, give them a call at Trinity Funeral Services. The number's on your screen. You can go to the website or make an appointment with them. Make the little trip up here to McHenry in Stone County for Trinity Funeral Services of the Gulf Coast.